we are gonna figure out this sleeping issue. What's going on guys? We're back at it. And this time we're here for good. That's what we've said every time. There she is. There Hi. she is. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. She doesn't sleep. She never sleeps. Ever. Ever, ever. ever. We have a shift right now. I'm up him from, I nap during the day, which I haven't napped today. I'm not gonna be screwed tonight. I nap during the day and I'm up until like three in the morning with her. And then magically, once Stella wakes up and she starts cuddling the baby, she falls asleep. So, um, we're gonna fix that. We're gonna fix that. Let me go get it. This, ooh, oy. That's gonna do it. What do you think? Yeah, we'll see. <laughs> what do you think? Get this thing open. If you guys don't know anything about the snoo, you can watch a little clip of it right here. Smartest baby bed ever made, but the safest too. Like your own personal night nurse, Snoo quickly responds to cries with the extra white noise and motion your baby loved in the womb. I'm back. I caught them after they came back from the video clip. Nice. Can we keep this box? We have to ship it back, huh? Yeah. So we are renting this from the happiest baby on the block. I believe that's the, what the website is called. They also have this um, like video or movie that I think Travis and I are gonna watch tonight on how to have the happiest baby that there can be. They do? Oh, that's what yeah. you texted me. Um, and this, for, this is rented from that particular um, website. website. Yeah. You know, our parents didn't have half of what we have these days when it comes to babies. You know, my grandma didn't have an epidural. Your mom didn't either, huh? With me, she did. With my brother, didn't. <laughs> Who weighed more, you or TJ? I did. You weighed more? TJ okay, was so five pounds. She picked the right, the right kid to get an epidural with. Yeah. Ah, ha, ha. it looks nice. I got a glimpse of the fabric. Is this brand Is this new? I guess so. Okay. Oh, shoot, that's heck heavy. Holy snap. Oh. Your face seems happy with it. This is like a little snoogle thing. It's like a uh, swaddle, and it's supposed to soothe them. I don't understand. Oh. extra sack. I like it. Wow. We might even just buy this thing, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh, two extra sacks. It's <laughs> $12.99. not that bad. I think. This is leg B on it. Yeah, because this says leg A and this says A. This says B, this says B. This says B and this says A. So these are A. Yeah. These are B, I think. Parenthood has been amazing. Don't get me wrong. The sleeping part of it, though, it just goes out the window. I'll tell ya. Okay, some of these nights, you just don't know what to do with the baby. You're like, how do I make you happy? That is not right. These flare way out. And those two are... <laughs> Can those two see it? Oh, I love it. Oh, yeah. Huh? It's really nice. That's really nice. I like that. If this comes up, she'll go in here. Ooh, fancy. Fancy Lila. And this will go <laughs> like an experiment. Your hands. Is this how you do it? She doesn't put her feet down. Lila, put your feet down. 
That's fine. There you go. She put him down. <laughs> Good. Ah. There. <laughs> I'm sorry. She looks so funny. <laughs> Hannibal Lecter. <laughs> Not quite 11 p.m. Not quite her bedtime yet, but. I'm oh, sorry. She just straight up whipped her head back as hard as she can and expected me to catch her. Luckily, did you I catch did. Her? Oh, but, I oh my see. gosh. Well, hopefully, she sleeps until 1:30, and then the plan is to wake up at 1:30, feed her, change her, change her, feed her, put her back to bed, wake up at four, and do the same thing. Yeah, you're so short. And yeah, that's about it. And then so the hopefully. seven, which is basically wake up time. Yes. Yeah. That's about it. We'll see you guys at 11. All right. Getting ready for session number one in the snow. And that's where we put it, right by our bed. <sighs> So cute. Yeah. Straighten your legs, Lila. Should be fine, then. I think maybe it'll make her legs so tight. Yeah, probably. Like that? Yeah. So I have my app ready here. <laughs> I don't know why she looks so funny. <laughs> she is pooped and peed and changed. And we're supposed to wake up at 1.30 to feed her. All right. We'll see you guys in the middle of the night. So she woke up twice. And, I mean, not bad all in all. Yeah. She got one hour stretches. She got one hour. Two one hour stretches? Like two one hour stretches. I mean, one she woke up because she threw up everywhere. Yeah, the first time she woke up, she threw up. Yeah. So I get that. And the second time, um, she's chowing down, so she's hungry. We shall see. So far, I think it's working okay. I think it's, it's working okay. Not this miracle worker that's not that's gonna make it so you never wake up again, but it's definitely helping. I think. So oh, we'll yeah, we'll get. Definitely help. We'll keep it going. Yeah. That was a rough night. Okay. I was telling them how she did not sleep. <laughs> um, I don't think that that speaks to this new entirely i think that she's just one heck of a baby so we're gonna try it for the next couple nights and let you know what we think yeah. so this is it now if we start the snoo it starts moving a little bit and then if she starts crying it will automatically recognize the cry and bring it up to level number one. It's faster. And go to level two if he continues to cry. It's faster. It will go to level three. It's also playing like a noise. I think that's the noise that they hear when they're in the womb, something similar to that. It's level three. And then there's level four. So the more she cries, the more this intensifies, which is supposed to cover this level. This is the max level. None of that really had an effect on her. The more it moved, actually, the more she seemed to cry. <laughs> so, night number two is over. It went a lot better. <laughs> Ellie, watch out, what are you doing? Anyways, it went a lot better. Actually, when she slept, like for an hour, and then was up for 45 minutes, and she yeah. slept for an hour. Hour stretches, that is basically what we want for now. And then she slept from 4 a.m. to 6. Yeah. So, so far, I recommend. 
Uh, we'll try it again tonight, a third time, and then we'll show you how the settings work as well. Travis has a good grasp on it, though. You have a good grasp on it. It has a thing going with it. I have figured this little jigsaw puzzle out. I mean, it's not that she doesn't like this new, it's that she prefers her lounger. She prefers to lay in this thing. But, big updates with this new, it is working pretty good. She just actually had her fourth night in it, and it is doing, <laughs> she's smiling right now. <laughs> yeah, you like that? She just lays in this, this boppy lounger all day. <laughs> Hi. Anyways, it's not that, yeah, that the snoo doesn't work or anything. It is, I think she just prefers laying in things like this, this lounger, but it is working. Right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So Last working. night she slept. Wait, where's the app? So it gives you a sleep cycle. I'll put it on the screen so you guys can see. It, it gives you a sleep cycle. Uh, last night she slept from 11.13 p.m. to 11.59 p.m. That's not bad. And then she made bigger strides and she went from 11.59 to 1.20 a.m. No. Am I reading this wrong? The blue is so... The sleep. sleep. Okay, she went to bed at 11.59 p.m. last night and she slept until 1.20. So we got an hour and 21 minutes of sleep right there. The whites are the pickups. And then from 1.20 to 1.50, we picked her up, we fed her, we changed her. Then from 1.50 to 3.12, she fell asleep again. That's pretty good. Yeah. That is not bad at all. And then she woke up at 3.12 a.m. And then at 3.33 a.m., we put her back to bed. And then she woke up 50 minutes later at 4.22 a.m. And then we're up for about a half hour. And then from 4.53 to 5.27. It's funny, as the night went on, she slept less and less intervals. At the end of the night, I just put her in her boppy lounger on the bed with us, and she slept for like an hour. But um, I'll show you how it works. I'll, I'll show you how it works. It puts your kid to sleep. Yeah, it's, it's one. It's 1.38 in the morning, and this one hasn't gone to sleep yet, so this new is not going to be, it's not going to fix every single problem that you have. Keep that in mind. She's super awake. Super awake. Yeah. Oh,